Hey guys, we're the masters of crafting. Today we just have Ethan and me here. And we're coming here with our invention that we accidentally came across. And this invention is a repeater. Or um... A clock. A clock. Pretty much what it does is pulses super fast. You wanna see how fast? That's how fast. So, there's so many things you can do with this. It's like a 5 o'clock repeater, but it's much faster. And the best part about it is, we have an off button here. You can set the time. If you set the repeaters to like 4 or 3, let's do, uh... Does it matter if they're both on the same thing? I don't know, let's try, let's it, try out. it out. Okay, this one's on 4 and that one's on 2 or whatever. 2. Yes, it does. Okay, so they... No, it doesn't. No, it does. They have to be on the same thing. So, they have to be... You can set how fast you, this repeater is going. As you can see, it is now going much slower than last time. And then if we just stop it, set it to... Why is it not stopping? <laughs> okay. We're going to stop it by setting the repeater because it was too slow to stop it. <laughs> okay, so now we're going to set it both to two and start it. And we can see it's much faster. Um, you can't set it while it's going, but you can just press the off button and set it. And there's there's so many things you can do with this. Okay, so uh, let's build that contraption we just had like two seconds ago. All right, I have we have some space over here. Well, wait, I have oh no this one. Oh that. So if we do this and bring this around, boop 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 boop, and turn it on. Turn it on. Boop. On button. You can see that it doesn't work very well. So we just put a repeater here. Two repeaters here. And we'll just set this to, like, three or something. Or not three. Sometimes this glitches out. Um, but anyways, as you can see, it's freaking cool. So we'll just turn it off. Now, for some reason, uh, let's go over here and set it up. Um, actually, let's do it right here. Let's do it right here again, because the off button is in the way. Um, let's set it up to a dispenser. So we'll just go like this. And we need four spaces. Funny. Um, well, actually, we only need three. One for a uh, repeater, because otherwise it's too fast for the dispenser. That's how fast it is. Um, so, uh, hold on. Uh, it's private for some reason. Let me just, let me just put the arrows in. Um, so, let's see. Uh, arrows, 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 arrows. Where are they? Do you know where arrows are, Ethan? No, I do not. You're quite quiet when it comes to recording. <laughs> okay. Quite quiet, anyways. Quite quiet. You are quite... Oh, how'd you put arrows in there? Because I had extra arrows in my inventory. Oh, but it's a private for some reason. Okay, anyways. If we turn it on... see it's very fast now if we turn it to for some reason when it's on a certain tick you don't know what it is for some reason it's different every time it will start going different speeds faster usually I don't know exactly what what how it works as you can see if you put it just normal nothing will shoot out it's too fast, and I don't have a repeater. Hold on. Um, now, I don't know if this is faster than a five o'clock repeater for dispensers. That's much slower. We got it working much faster than this, though. Let's turn it off, and let's um, set it to let's set it to one. And let's say, oh, that's why, this is not, this is at 2. Oh. That's why it's slower. 
and then if we set it to 2, for some reason 2 makes it faster. And you can see all of this, it does not burn out. Like some of the 5 o'clock repeaters. 3, for some reason, is weird. And 4 is fast again. So, I mean, there are so many options with this. 1 is slower than 4 for some reason. I don't know why, don't ask me. And now 4 isn't doing that. It is crazy. Okay, so, we're just gonna destroy that. Um, so, yeah. Ethan? Yeah? Why don't you tell us how we build this? Um, well, I was looking for a way to get an, in an infinite uh, circuit from a button. From a button. And we found it, and it also... Then he wanted a Repeats. way to turn it off, so I decided, hey, what if we have a piston go over a block in here so it stops? Well, we did that, and for some reason, it starts going haywire and starts freaking doing stuff, and then it's like, holy crap, we just made an invention. And then for an off button, we just did the same thing on the other side to stop it. So what happens is, when you turn the button on, it goes to this and it activates the thing, and for some reason... Um, it, it does that. And then if you press it again, it just does the same thing, unless we press the off button. So here is how it, here is the, um, what it looks like. Let me just press F1. As you can see, what it looks like. Now, um, for this piston right here, that actually does, um, activate, or like, this one right here is which is, which is the one that makes it, uh, repeat. It has to be going to the back of it for some reason. Let's show you guys. Um, if you do this, and you can't place that on glowstone for some reason. I didn't know you couldn't place redstone on glowstone. As you can see, it doesn't work. It, I, I think it has to do something with the timing. It's too fast, maybe. But that works. So, um, so you saw the schematics, or the how it worked, or... Um, where it is this doesn't matter right here it can be like this and you can make this off button the wiring go underground to this piston doesn't matter um, but yeah show it one more time pause it and you can build it right here make sure the first piston here from the button is going that way and the second one's going that way and make sure you have this hole indent here and then this goes on top of it right here okay so now that we have this let's go to the compact version okay all right. Now this was made by um, our other master of crafting. Um, he just compressed it a little bit. As you see, the off button is under there, and I'll show you the schematics for this. Kind of just above view. Um, yeah, you can find your own way to um, to compress it if you want, and you can also find your own way to get the off button to work underground but anyways um, we have the on button here and the button comes out from the left side it goes to a repeater to go to this this goes over here on a repeater through this way under here and the repeaters in the middle are facing the same way so that's pretty much it um, this can be used for so many different things remember you can uh, adjust the timing of this repeater or this clock by setting both of them to the same thing make sure they're both on the same thing and then it will be different speed as you see that's much slower than the first one for some reason it should be like not even that much slower but anyways is that it is that all we have i think so okay yeah uh thanks depending on how many comments we have we might build a have a tutorial yeah we pretty much we pretty much uh basically told you how to make it I mean yeah. there's really no other way just make sure you have the repeaters facing the same way and you have the piston coming from the back and it should work so thanks guys for watching um, please get this video popular because it's much better than a five o'clock repeater I and it's much more compressed as well I mean I mean maybe not much more but it's it's about the same a little less and it's much faster there is some there is some problems with it with coming off the sides with the repeaters and stuff like some of it's crazy i don't i don't even know how it works so 
thanks guys for watching and see you guys later bye goodbye, goodbye.